Hello, Steve White, Steve Arts 89. Well, we finally have an actor cast to replace Jonathan um, Kent in Superman and Lois. And I, I, I'm, n no. Um, he's not the right fit. His name is Michael Bishop. He's an Australian actor. And he looks just like Jordan. Um, now, um, Jordan, the character. The actor Jordan um, Elsass left. I had some personal problems. I don't know if they were mental health problems or if I, he, he basically didn't show up to the set and they fired him. And he put out a message basically saying he had to put his men, it came across as he had to put his mental health first. I don't know what his deal is, there seem to be personal reasons. But this new actor, he looks just like the actor who plays his brother Jordan. Um, I hope I'm not getting the names confused. I always get them confused. Jonathan is the one who left, the character, the actor who left, played by Jordan. And the other character is Jordan, and um, yeah, Michael Bishop is playing him. It's, uh, he looks just like he looks just like his brother. Yes, I mean in one way that works because they will look like brothers, but he doesn't look anything like the Jordan character. It's just wrong. Um, and I'm like, what were they thinking? Were they thinking, oh gee, he looks like him. He could pass as his brother. We don't want to try and replace the actor and try and just find out actually looks just like him. So we'll find an actor who looks like he could be related to the other. It's going to be jarring, and whenever you watch the episodes, you're going to be like, oh, it's, it's, it doesn't work. They Have they not learned from Roseanne? Have they not learned from Bewitched? Do these people not learn? Do these people not know popular culture? You can't swap a character, and if you do, you have to re do a good job re replacing them. Like, Sarah Chalk really was nothing like um, the, the other actress who played the original Becky in Roseanne. Um... She was taller, she couldn't act. I mean, she can't, she's turned into a good actress now, but she could not act the first year of that show. She was absolutely woeful. And she didn't look like Lacey Garson. I think that's how you na say her name. But they hired her anyway, because I guess they thought she was hot. I don't know. But um, when you see them together, and they did a couple of scenes together later um, in the revival series, it's just weird. And um, Dick York being replaced on Bewitched and just... As, you know, no, why, why? I mean, God, there are so many actors out there. Just find someone who looks like the actor. And yes, he'll always kind of maybe feel like he was just replacing the actor and blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Think of the audience first. But they're, they're just going for this other approach of let's find someone who looks like they could be related to the other actor, the other son. And even though the, maybe they'll bleach his hair. Maybe, I, I don't know. It's just, no, I saw the photo and I'm like, no. So just no. It's just a solid no. I just had to say no. I'm going to go. Bye.